Hi, this is Mark Harrison with a preview of our Pop Piano Book video instruction series, Chapter 7. Our Pop Piano Book keyboard method is used by many thousands of musicians around the world, and we've now created a 35 minute video lesson accompanying Chapter 7, which deals with four part over root chords. These are also referred to as upper structure four part voicings. This is the secret to how a lot of R&B and funk harmony is created. Let's check out some excerpts from this video lesson. First, we'll compare triad over root and four part over root voicings for minor seventh chords in an R&B pop comping style. I'm going to demonstrate this difference now with a simple minor chord progression, let's say moving from A minor to E minor. If I voice both those chords as minor sevenths by building major triads from their thirds, like back in chapter five, it would sound like this. Let's have a listen. So next I'll build major seven shapes from the thirds of both of those minor chords, like in figure 7.1. Let's have a listen to that setting. Next, we'll use four part upper structures to voice a suspended five chord moving to a tonic chord in an R&B ballad style. So next, I'm going to demonstrate these suspended dominant chord voicings in a couple of different five to one chord progressions. This is where we're building a chord from the fifth degree, and then returning to the first degree of a key. This is commonly how these suspended dominant chords are used as five chords and I'll improvise an R&B ballad setting to demonstrate these. Next, we'll voice lead minor ninth chords around the circle of fifths in a swing eighths reggae style. So next in this video lesson, I'm going to skip ahead a little bit to some stylistic treatments of those minor ninth voicings that we just heard. So we'll check out figure 7.9 over on page 97. It presents exactly that same sequence that we saw in figure 7.5, but now in a swing eights reggae comping style. Let's have a listen to some of that. So there I played the first few measures for you up to the B flat minor nine voicing in measure six. Finally, in this preview, we'll voice lead suspended dominant chords around the circle of fifths in a swing sixteenths funk style. So next I'll improvise a swing sixteenth funk comping pattern based on the first four voicings shown in figure 7.14 there. Again, moving the right hand down back around the middle C area. Let's have a listen. The complete video lesson covers all of the chapter seven content in depth, including all commonly used upper structure four part voicings, using these voicings to interpret chord symbols and progressions, as well as applying them in different styles. For the best results, we recommend using this video lesson together with the Pop Piano Book. You can order the Pop Piano Book and the video instruction series from our website at harrisonmusic.com. I hope you enjoy our chapter seven lesson and good luck with your music.